the, let me just activate the class, okay? So Ta, welcome to our class. Okay, I see like your face uh, here in, the, in your eyebrow. So nice. I was gonna tell you, now we are starting with a new lesson, all right? A new class. Yeah. But before going ahead with the new class, I would like to ask you, what do you remember about our last class? Our, our class, we are <clears throat> learning about friend, continuous prisoner, a symbol, and a bus symbol, bus continuous, bus okay. symbol. Okay, in, uh, in our last class, in our last class, that's right, we yes. talked, we talk about the past simple and past continuous. That is right. We did many exercises, all right? <laughs> With the many, all right? It was, a, a, you know, a, a huge interaction. We took so many things, all right? Especially all right. the exercise. We, we were thinking a lot, all right? But now we are having something new, as usual. In addition to this, Tao, I remember I assigned you a homework, right? Yes. Okay, this is what we are going to do here. Um, do you think you can share to me a picture of your homework? Yes. Yeah, this way, this way what I can do is to check and correct your homework. So maybe here you can send it. So you can, uh, are you in a computer? So you can use uh, here in Zoom, you can use here the, the auction of file, all right? And then you send a picture and then later, I am gonna check it to correct, to correct it. Or mm -hmm. let me see something, let me see something. Do you have, do you have your book? Do you have your book? Let me see there, let me see. Okay, I think I'm not gonna be able to see old. Okay, yeah, I can. You do it. Let me see. Okay, perfect. <laughs> Let me just a screenshot. I'm sorry. So just to have it here. This way is gonna be. Okay, sounds good. Let me see. Okay, okay, okay. Very well. You have shy. You have the adjectives. Okay. Anyway, later we're gonna practice. We're gonna see how we can get a picture to see all that. Okay, so now let's continue with our new lesson, Tao. Oh, I'm sorry, that's not it. Let me just go back. Okay. So landscape, that's our amazing new topic, landscape. Tao, yes. do, you, do you know what is a landscape? Mm, no, I don't. Okay, yeah. let me show you. Can you see that? Yes. Uh, that is a landscape and I am going to show you more landscape. Look at here. Let me just open this here. I will show you more so that you can see what is, what a landscape is. Just one second. Okay, see this. Okay, see this? Can you see? So that is a landscape, all right? So this is a beautiful natural landscape. Here you can see another war, another one. You know, maybe yeah. over there, back there, the glaciers, all right? 
There you can see the Aurora. In this one, Tau, you can see here the Aurora Borealis, right? Kind of like beautiful lining. So we have so many types of landscapes, right? Look at this. I know that in Vietnam, you guys have beautiful, be beautiful landscapes. Let me just show you here some, let me see some Vietnamese landscapes. I'm sure that Vietnam has a lot of beautiful things. Oh my God. When I see this, I can appreciate the beauty of Vietnam. Do you know this place? Uh, yes. <laughs> I wish I could see it. This night. Nice. I was looking at it before when I was preparing the lesson. And this is a popular island I was talking about. Okay. Yeah. This one. It's very beautiful. It's a paradise. So let's continue. Okay. Clear with this. Tao, that is a landscape. Okay. Okay. Any, yeah, any, any kind of like a place you can see, all right, they have landscape. So example here, you see the children, like some of them are reading, some of them are maybe writing, one of them has a ruler handy, and this is a beautiful landscape too. Okay, so now... Okay. So we are going to, okay, learn about some landscapes. So this is what we are going to do. I want you to pay close attention. So look at here. Uh, let me ask you something. I have a question for you. Okay, I want you to look at the picture. Look at well, all right? Look at the, the picture and then... Uh, and let me ask you something. Where would you prefer to live? Maybe in the countryside, in the city. Look at here. It seems to be kind of like a countryside. But if you look at there, all right, you see yes. that this is the downtown. Uh, I, uh, I prefer to live in a countryside countryside a quiet yeah. life right yeah. <laughs> okay because, and why because in the city you have traffic a lot, of, and, a lot uh, of traffic yes and there are in the some place is a uh, pollution <laughs> that is correct so yeah that is right that is right pollution yeah because of the smoke of the cars and vehicles right the yeah. you know the spread of um the spread of pollution all right and yeah. however uh, in the countryside all right in the countryside so you have the advantage that life is quiet so you feel like relax you feel yeah. like <laughs> not too much like not too many cars not too much traffic, yeah. you know, here in the city. So we have like the pressure when people are going to work. So like you see themselves pushing one another, especially in America. So there are some pros and cons. So now, okay. So your yeah. perspective, your perspective is that you like the countryside because life, yeah, the life in, in the countryside is, is, quiet right yes okay i i agree with that with that part i also like the countryside so it's kind of like something different to me <laughs> that's very good so let's continue here so since you told me tao that you like the countryside also yeah i i cannot deny that i like both i like the countryside and uh, the the city as well the downtown the village and what is the reason it's because sometimes you know 
in the in the downtime you have like you want to buy something but it's kind of like you can go to the supermarket you can go real quick to the pharmacy everything is there compared mm. to the countryside like you have to maybe walk a little bit more or you know drive and then <clears throat> sorry it might take you know a bit a bit of time but going back to the topic what is that we are going to do here what we are going to do here in this class now is to listen to the vocabulary we are going yeah. to match all right here we have we have like 25 we have 25 words vocabulary words and we are going to match which one is corresponding to uh the pictures we can see as usual you know like uh we're going to match we are going to match like the pictures with the image okay so let's continue let's continue all right so let me play yeah. the audio unit three lesson three a exercise two one telegraph pole two okay road works three bus stop Four. So, would you like to? Uh, okay, I'm sorry. You know. Do you want me to go back and like, um, uh, like keep uh, stopping, right? Do you want me to keep stopping like one by one so that you have more chances to listen well the information tell? Uh, yes. Yeah, let's do it gradually. So this way you can, mm. pro you can process, you can process the information. I will really like you to understand clearly the pronunciation of the words so you can pronounce better, okay? Yeah. Okay, so let's do it again one more time. So here we are. Here we go. All right. It's three. Lesson 3A, exercise two, one. Telegraph pole. Okay. Two. Road works. Three. Bus stop. Four. Street lamp. Okay. Five. Road side. Okay, I'm gonna stop it there. So, did you manage to listen the vocabulary? Yes. <clears throat> okay, so perfect. Then I am going to continue. I am gonna be, okay. uh, I'm gonna be pausing. If you want, you can repeat it. That's gonna be better. Okay, so let's continue now. And mm. then we go to the interaction we're going to have. Five. Road sign. Okay, road fire. Okay. Six. Post box. Post box. Seven. Pavement. Pavement. Okay. Eight. Yes. Traffic lights. Traffic lights. Nine. Billboard. Billboard. Like yes. Ten. Ten. Rubbish bin. Rubbish bin. Okay. Eight. So let me stop it here. So you listen well? Uh, yeah, yes. Okay, let's continue. So I'll give you more chances so that you can listen well. 11. 11. Pedestrian crossing. Pedestrian crossing. 12. Okay. Roundabout. Roundabout, okay. 13. 13. Wood. Wood. 14. 14. Pawn. Pawn. Okay. Fifteen. Fifteen. Cottage. Cottage or cottage in American English. Sixteen. But we say cottage. Farmhouse. So um, something I'm going to tell you. So the standard way is cottage. All right. Cottage. But then don't, don't get surprised 
if you listen to cottage 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 yeah here uh you you know the uh, standard way the standard way to pronounce is gonna be like cottage is the standard one but we normally pronounce like cottage but that's here in america you know here so we pronounce like cottage so if you okay. yeah it's the standard the standard form so it's gonna be cottage but don't get surprised if you see that somebody oh an american person you talk to an american or maybe it might happen to a canadian all right so it depends of course so it's going to pronounce like cottage all right cottage or uh, especially yeah let's, that's right and especially new york city new york boston new york boston i think in jersey too new jersey so you know yeah. like yeah i'm just telling you you know in case that you see this pronunciation you know okay okay so let's continue 17 field okay field 18 bridge the bridge 19 bridge. stream stream is right 20 pond the pond all right so let me stop it here i'm going to stop it right here okay you listen well the words uh yeah i think yes in case that you did do not listen well so i can also go back and repeat it there is no problem in it yeah okay so now let's continue we already have we have already listened to 20 words so now it's, we are going to listen five more words, all right? Yeah. Yeah. 21. 21. Village. Village. 22. Footpath. Footpath, all right. 23. Lane. 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 24. 24. Gate. Okay. Yes. 25. Hedge. That's the hedge. So now let's see. So what is, uh, now I am going to ask you, Tao, what is the corresponding number for billboard? Uh, it's nine. Okay. Let's see. The, let me see here. So, okay, so let's do something. I'm gonna do something since it's gonna give me the numbers like all of them, uh, like knowing the sequence it is. So, mm -hmm. let me see, okay. You say billboard number nine, right? Right. Okay, let's see. So let me check here. Okay, so that's number one. Would you like me to share with you my mouse, the mouse of my computer, my remote. Okay, I am going to give you the mouse. You can use my, the mouse and point at the, the image, all right, the picture. So now you have access to my mouse. You can now point at the, the drawing. Uh. Yeah, try to share, try to, yeah, can you see? <laughs> okay, so now you have, okay, that's number nine, billboard. Okay, pavement, which one is pavement? Our pavement is uh, our seven. Number seven, can you show yeah. me with the mouse? Okay, so you have access with the mouse. You have access to my computer now. Show me with the cursor. Right here. Good. Show me. Uh, Can you do it? Is, uh, or is that difficult for you to like to maneuver? 
the mouse. Okay, let, anyway. I know sometimes it's tedious. No, don't worry. I can help you, don't worry. Okay, so let me see here. Okay, here it is the cursor. So look at here, yeah, that's number seven. Okay, pavement. So let's see the other ones. So we have the pox box. Okay, road to work, number two. So let's continue, the bus stop number three. So, okay, in the same sequence we are having, can you tell me son of them? The same sequence, like, uh, you know, the ones we are missing. Billboard, what is the, well, Billboard, you already told me is number nine. So yeah. we, we are missing now rubbish bin. Which one is rubbish bin? Uh, rubbish bin and uh, I think 10. 10, let me see, let me see. Well done, good job. Yeah, that's a, based on the picture, this is a rubbish bin. Okay, uh, pedestrian crossing. Uh, there's the 11. Okay, pedestrian crossing, you mentioned that is number 11. Okay, yeah. roundabout. Uh, it's, uh, mm, thing is Do you know what is a roundabout? Let me show you. Look at what is a roundabout. Let me show you the picture here. So this way I don't have to share. Look at here. I'm gonna show you my telephone roundabout. See this. So like, look at this, it's like the intersection. So look at here, can you see? Let me see, can you see it well? Oh uh, yes. That's a roundabout, like you know, you have like the four, four streaks, all right? Like this one, can you see here? And then yeah. there they take different directions. This is what we call roundabout. For example, the one who goes, the one that goes to the left, to the right, the ones that uh, the, the cars that uh, are going to go forward or backwards. And because of that, dirts are roundabout. Okay? okay. So let's continue. So traffic lights, what is the car responding number? Uh is the eight. I'm sorry, you say number eight? Yes. Let me see, let me track it, just to make sure whether you have it correct or not. Let me see, oh yeah, good job. Okay, <laughs> great job, Tao. You're doing well. So now let's talk about rural, all right, rural landscapes right so we have barn what is it barn is uh, 14 <clears throat> 14 let me see just to make sure you got it well you say number 14 uh, yes okay oh yeah this one that is right so next one Cottage. Uh, fifteen. Okay, perfect. So we got Phil. Uh, Phil is uh, seventeen. Seventeen. Let me see. Well done. So we got over here. We got field. Uh, okay. I mean gate. A gate is the. Uh, 24. 24. Let me see, just to make sure. Oh, yeah, that's right. You're correct. So let's continue. Then uh, we have 
stream. Our stream is our mm, I, 19. Okay, 19. Well, that's right. Well done. Good job. Wood. Wood. What is, uh, which one is wood? Do you know? Uh, uh, 13. Okay, 13. That's right. Well done. Let me see number next one. Bridge. What's the corresponding number? Bridge is uh, 18. 18, that's right. Okay, so then we have farmhouse. What's the corresponding number for this one? Uh, is um, 16. Okay, so then we have lane. What's the corresponding number for lane? Lane is uh, uh, 23. 23, let's see. So let's compare. Very good job. <laughs> Fantastic, you are so active, uh, Tao. So let's, con let's continue. So then we have, um, well, I already mentioned the bridge. Farmhouse. What is the corresponding number to farmhouse? Uh, uh, ten or ten. Uh, do you understand this word? Okay. Or would you like me to show you? Yes. Okay, let me show you here. I am going to show you a picture. Farmhouse so that you can see the image. So, look at here, this is, okay, a, a farmhouse is kind of like the type of house that obviously is in a farm. Look at there. So can you see, let me see. Can you see this one? Uh, yes. <laughs> this is a farmhouse. You know, it's a, it's a, normally it's a house that is probably in the countryside or maybe, okay, in a farm, you know, but sometimes very good, very presentable, sometimes, sometimes are very comfortable, okay? So yes. let's continue. Mm -hmm. Let's go on. Foot footpath. Our footpath is our twenty-two. Twenty-two. Let me see just to make sure. Okay. Yeah, that's right. Let me see. Hedge. Hedge is our twenty-five. Twenty-five. That's right. Okay. Mm -hmm. So let me see if there is another one. Pond. Pond. Pond is a 20. 20, that is correct. And finally, we have village. Our village is 21. 21, that is correct. Perfect. So you did it very well. So now, okay, so this is what we are going to do here. As you already know this, we are going to proceed. Let me just show you the answer. So this way you can compare your answers, how good you did it. Okay. So you see, the majority of them, pretty much the majority, you did it very well. Thank you. Thank you for being so smart. Yeah, thank you. Okay, so let's continue. So here we have the vocabulary again, as usual, as we, do, as we always do. So we are going to complete the sentences with the word below. So can you tell me what are the words below before we complete the exercise? Mm. Look at here. Content. Cottage. Cottage. Five. Wit. Oh, land, pavement, corn, roadside, rubbish bin, 
street okay. traffic light. That is correct. So now we are going to complete the exercise. All right. Yes. So number one, I can read the. I can read the road signs. Okay. Let's see. Road signs. That's right. Well done. Number two, we drive. Uh, we drive along the. Mm. Along the oh, Len. Good job. So you got number now. Let's go ahead with number three. The horse cape from the uh, from the uh, from the pond from the field. Yeah. From the field, all right? The horse yeah. escaped from the field by jumping over the, yeah. the, the gate. gate. All right, the gate. Yeah. So number four. The number four, if you don't want sandwich, put it in the rubbish bin. Rubbish bin. Then now I want you to read number five. Help me out. The town center is very dark. They need more dark. The town dark. center is very dark. Yeah. They need more traffic light. Okay, so the town center is very dark. They need yeah. more traffic light traffic traffic lights. Traffic light. All right. Yeah. So Let's continue, Tao. Well done. Oh, in this case, a strip land. All right. Yes. Okay. So let's continue with number six. A state on the first day on the pavement. Great job. A state yes. on the pavement. Remember the pronunciation? Pavement. Pavement. It's kind of like, look at this. There is a final, like, T sound. Pavement. 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 So it's not like you're going to say, like, pavement. No, no, no. It's just, like, soft. You know what I mean? Like, very soft. It's, it's kind of like pretty much silent, not totally, but you say pavement, 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 pavement. You got it. The last one. Please keep it in your mind all the time. Like the last one, all right? Yes. <laughs> the last one was good. Okay, so let's see here. Stay on the pavement when you you are waiting to cross the road. So now number seven, all right? Number seven, we got number seven. Can you read it for me? Why are the traffic light always red when I'm in a hurry? Okay, why are the traffic lights always red? <laughs> wow, when I'm in a hurry. You know what it means? Like the person is in a hurry and then the traffic lights is red. <laughs> the person gets desperate. Like, you know, but that's part of the rule. To be good citizens, to be yeah. good citizens, we have to do that to take care of us, our lives, and to, yeah. to, to take care of the others. All right, so let's go with number eight. What is number eight? Uh, my aunt lives in a beautiful uh, cottage in a small village. Okay, cottage. Or cottage. Cottage, if you want. It's, if you want, you can also say cottage. That That's okay. In a small village. Yeah. All right. So, number nine. I sit through the board and it landed in a 
pond with a splash. Well done. She threw the ball and it landed, okay? Landed there. in the pond with a splash. splash. <laughs> well done. So now there is something very interesting here. So we're having the preposition of movements. So Tao, can you see these prepositions? Uh, yeah, yeah right but here. in the picture with the yeah, paper. Uh, actually, we are gonna do this activity. No need to read yeah. it. So what I want you to, I'm gonna tell you what to do here, obviously. Mm -hmm. What okay. I want you to do especially is to know just prepositions, all right? So we have here, what is the first one, Tao? Uh, is, um, bus? The, the first preposition. Look at here, let me show you something. So here we have the first preposition, across is the first one. Okay. Yeah. And we have here, over. Over. over, yeah, over, yeah. past, past, through, Alan. Uh, let's Alan. see now. So now let's see how to use them. So okay. look at here. You have the first one, past. Okay. Yes. Yes. Past. So then we have. Alan. Alan. And what is the Alan. next one? There is a. Uh, over okay so let's see yeah. over that is correct <laughs> number mm -hmm. four uh, is a true true through a uh, true yeah no it's true. not like true like true or false no 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 through true. true repeat that after me through the park through the park park huh through through okay so that's true let's continue number five across across that's right so okay. now we continue okay yeah so this is what we are going to do now please listen carefully okay listen carefully to a walker do you know what is a walker yeah. A walker, a person who walk, who walks. All right. Listen carefully to a walker asking, all right, yes. asking a farmer for the directions. All right. Then we are going to mark the route okay. of the picture B above. So listen yes. carefully. Here we are. Lesson 3A. Can you listen? Exercises 4 and 5. Excuse me. Hear what? Excuse me. I wonder if you I can help. I can't hear you. Can you turn the engine off? Wait a moment. I'll turn the engine off. <sighs> Let me go back. Let me go back. Seems to be a little bit funny. Okay, so listen again. So look at yes. here. Okay, I'm gonna play it one more time. Sorry, give me a second. I'm sorry. So let me see. Okay, so I'm gonna show you here. All right, so let me go back to. Okay. So let's listen again, please, please listen carefully, all right. Lesson 3A, exercises okay. four and five. Excuse me. You what? Excuse me, I Excuse wonder if you I can help. I can't hear you. Can you turn the engine off? Wait a moment. I'll turn the engine off. I can't listen. Uh, can you help me? 
I'm looking for a village called Chomley. You mean Chumley? That's how people around here say it. OK. <laughs> Chumley, thanks. No problem. Afternoon. Are you able to listen to the audio? Can you listen? No. no. OK, let me do something just to make sure. No problem. I can't I can solve this. OK. What about now? Can you can you listen? I'm going to replay back again. Okay. So lesson three A. Can you listen now? Exercises four and five. Okay. Pay attention. That's very funny. Excuse me. You what? <laughs> Excuse me. I wonder if you I can help. I can't hear you. Can you turn the engine off? Wait a moment. I'll turn the engine off. Can you help me? I'm looking for a village called Chomley. You mean Chumley? That's how people around here say it. OK. <laughs> Chumley, thanks. No problem. Afternoon. Oh, wait. Uh, sorry. Excuse me. Yes? Can you tell me where Chumley <laughs> is? Of course. Go along this lane, go past the pond, then go through the gate on your left. Go across the field, just follow the footpath, and then go through another gate. Turn right onto the lane, and then go straight on. Go over the bridge, go past the farmhouse on your left, take the first right, and walk to the end of the road. Then you're in Chomley. Don't you mean Chumley? That's right. Chumley. Great. So I go past the. Do you want me to repeat uh, again this part? Tao? Yeah. <laughs> I know it's, it's a long direction. It's kind of like crazy, you know, because of that. It's something like, you know, crazy because um, the. Do you know the many directions he's given to her? So listen yeah. again, listen again, listen again. So I'm going to do it from here. Okay, listen to the directions. Excuse me. Okay. Yes? Can you tell me where Chumley is? Of course. Go along this lane, okay. go past the pond, past then the go pond. through the gate on your left. Okay. Go across the field, just follow the footpath, the and then go through another gate. Turn right onto the lane, and then go straight on. Go over the bridge, go past the farmhouse on your left, take the first right, and walk to the end of the road. Then you're in Chomley. Don't you mean Chomley? That's right. Chomley. Great. So I go past the pond and through the gate on my right. The gate on your left. Uh, and I go around the field. You go across the field. Oh, yes. I follow the footpath. Uh, then I go... Uh, Sorry, can you tell me again, please? You go through another gate, then you turn right onto the lane and go over the bridge. You go past the farmhouse and you're there. OK, so I go... Sorry, how do I start? You go past the pond and through... Look... Jump up on the tractor. I'm going there myself. I'll give you a lift. Oh, thanks very much. At the end of the lesson, at the end, he says, I give you a lift. Here in America, we use, I give you a ride. So he said, I give you a lift. So he always say, I give you a ride. Okay? Okay. 
So let's see, did, did you listen to the directions, Tao? Yeah. <laughs> so many direct directions, but now we are going to see. So first one. So we are going to listen again and complete with the direct directions. I'm yes. Sorry. Let's see here. Okay, listen, listen here. Listen to this. Lesson 3A. Exercises 4 and 5. Excuse me. You what? Excuse me. I wonder if you I can help. I can't hear you. Can you turn the engine off? Wait a moment. I'll turn the engine off. Okay. Can you help Where me? You listen, then we I'm looking for a village called Chomley. You mean Chumley? That's how people around here say it. Okay. <laughs> Chumley, thanks. No problem. Afternoon. Oh, wait. Uh, sorry. Excuse me. Yes? Can you tell me where Chumley <laughs> is? Of course. Go along this lane. Okay. Go past the pond. Okay. Then go through the gate on your left. Okay. Go across the field. Just follow the footpath. And then go through another gate. Okay. Turn right onto the lane. Okay. And then go straight on. Okay. Go over the bridge. Go past the farmhouse on your left. Take the first right and walk to the end of the road. Then okay. you're in. So here we are. Let's just stop here. Let me see real quick. I don't know if you have it, Tao. So number one, go. Along this lane. Okay, along this lane. That's right. Number two. There is go. Pass. Pass the pond. Go past the pond. Number three. Yes. Go. Go through the gate. Okay. On your left. Okay. Number four. Is uh, go. Uh, I don't know. Across, <laughs> across the field. Yeah. Joss. Or the footpath. The footpath. You know what is a footpath? Yeah. Okay. So turn right. Turn right onto the lane. Then go or then go or straight. That's right. Um, <laughs> straight first, on. Take the first or uh, take the first right. Okay, take the first right. And we are to the end of the road. That is correct. Walk to the end of the run. That's right. Well done. Yeah. So we have finished this part. Then, uh, Tao, we have finished with today's class. So uh -huh. this is what, I, what was the last page I gave you uh, as a homework? Um, mm -hmm. Last page, I think I gave, can you tell me the, uh, let me see. So the page I gave you as a homework, let me look at here. I think I, got, I have it. So, uh, what I want you to do is that uh, with the workbook, I am going to get, I assign you, I assign to you number four and six. Four and five. Four and five, right? Yeah. And then I'm going to assign you as a homework and let me write it here. Your homework yeah. is going to be four and five. I think it's going to be six and seven. Check okay. there. Uh, could you show me your book? So look at there. If you can see also, there is a, a part of the of the work, the workbook, the workbook. That's right. The ones that has, you know, this in regards of the directions. Yeah. So let me see. Which this, page? This, yeah, which six. page is this one? Let's see. No, number six, right? Yes. Then you're going to do number six and seven. 
Okay. Number six and seven. Tao, thank you yes. so much for being in the class. It was such a great moment today to keep interacting. And I wish you keep this way, doing your best so that you can keep improving and improving as much as you can. Okay, thank you. See you. Thank, see you yeah. next class, Tao. Goodbye. Okay. Bye. Goodbye. See you again. See you.